Our state is two months into vaccination efforts, and while more than one million people have gotten their first shot, there's a lot of work to make sure that all of those people get their second and final dose as well. Lindsay Tooman is live at Cone Health's Green Valley campus this morning, and Lindsay, a number of healthcare workers right there are now fully vaccinated with both shots. It's such great news, Cindy, but yes, healthcare workers were in that first group of folks in our state to be eligible to get vaccinated, and now they have moved on past that. They're also doing phase two, uh, folks who are 65 and older, but the state dashboard shows more than 1 million first round doses to those first two groups of people in our state. Currently, a little bit more than 400,000 people are listed to have gotten their second dose as well, which means they have completed the process of getting vaccinated. I spoke to a group of doctors and nurses when they first got their shot and checked back in again after the second dose. They tell me it is a relief and it shows that there's a light at the end of the tunnel with this pandemic. Here at Cone Health, the number of COVID-19 patients is trending significantly downward. The latest midnight census shows 114 COVID-19 COVID patients in their facilities, but that number is still high. It hasn't dropped below 100 patients since November. So all these healthcare workers are glad to be vaccinated. They're also really pleased to see more people in the community getting their shots to help protect everyone in these months to come. That in and of itself is something that gives us confidence to know that we've got allies in the community who want to come in and help by getting a vaccine. It is a safe vaccine and the more people get vaccinated, the more we can have a collective immunity. It's called community immunity. So that will develop. And so that is what, yes, the vaccines are just rolling in. You don't, we don't have enough of vaccine right now, but when it's your turn, just go ahead and get the vaccine. So community immunity is probably going to take a little while longer. Cone Health is predicting by late spring, early summer, we could start to see the impact of vaccinations uh, lowering our infection rate. But it, yeah, it's going to be quite a bit. That's why those three W's wearing masks, social distancing, washing hands are not going away. I also know there's a lot of questions about side effects from that second shot uh, there. It is supposed to be a little bit more intense, but all of the doctors and nurses who I spoke to tell me that very minimal effects. They might have had a sore arm, a uh, little bit of cramp or body aches or fatigue, maybe a low grade fever, but everything was gone within 24 hours. So nothing lasting and nothing very intense either. Live in Greensboro, Lindsay Tooman, Fox 8 News.